Ah, God damn, man, what the fuck? Stop doing on this. Here? Oh, man. Why are you falling on the floor or something? Yeah. Don't hit me with that fucking bag. <laughs> Stop, dog. I'm going to the park eat and hang out, social distance, hang out. Okay. Some food? Please. I did set up the chairs. Oh, did you, did you think I meant like yeah. me yeah. getting the food? Oh, I was just asking if you wanted some food. I wasn't going to get it. <laughs> Says here. Social distance picnic. No, we don't call it picnic. That means pick a nigga. We we don't have picnics. Black people don't have picnics. We say cookouts or barbecues. We don't say picnics. You want a burger? Poof. Your burger. Huh? What you say? You want hookah? You want hookah? Like today? On a, what's today, Wednesday night? On a Wednesday night? Okay, no problem, I'll make you a hookah. Let's make a hookah. Chardonnay for you, ma'am. Is that okay? Okay. I have a princess doing my makeup. Have you ever had a princess do your makeup? I don't think so. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Join the Bunga Ninja game. And hey, we had to do mommy makeup and Sammy stand What she said. And she been wanting to do my makeup for so long. I actually even had people request this. So I'm like, okay, let me just do it, I guess. Show them. Show the camera. Okay. And you're going to put it on my face? Uh-huh. Rub it in first. Okay. Okay. And I'm going to watch Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Girl, your hands smell like chicken. Mm. You tell me. Okay, and now what? Mm -hmm. 
You, you come in it the opposite way. Oh yeah, there you go. There you go. No, I like my thick. I like my eyebrows thick like Beyonce. Um. Or Jojo. You know Jojo? Yes. I want my eyebrows like hers. Okay. Okay, you got me? Mm -hmm. Okay. I I put an eyeglasses on her and now I can do like this and then I can put it on her. Dry <laughs> She told me to dry it in the van, okay. Oh my God. Huh? Mm -hmm. Go like that. Go like what? Go like <laughs> Go like what? Go like this. Like this? Or like this? No, well this. Like this? Yeah. Okay. You got, you got lip gloss, your eyeglasses, and your and your friends. Mama, this is called eyeshadow, not eyeglasses. This is we can have eyeshadow. He did his neck. He's <laughs> soft. And so I ordered so much stuff from T N. Like, I didn't even realize that I ordered all of this stuff. Like, oh, I think this is that t-shirt dress. Okay. I love how she and package This is gonna be fire. This is gonna be fire when I wear it. Hers. Don't mind me, y'all. I'm ashy. I was just doing the dishes. It's heavy. Oh, I think this is a purse. Yeah. It's pretty heavy. Why should let me know if I should do a haul because it's legit a lot of stuff. This is a t-shirt dress. I'm going to wear this today. Um, me and my husband are going out for lunch today. It's a Friday. Yeah, so I'm rushing because I'm late. Um, so I already did my hair. So I already did my hair. Um, I put my scarf on. I'm just gonna put a little bit of makeup on, not a lot. And I'm going to speed this up. So enjoy.
and I just do it by myself Makeup. I did that in like 15 minutes. I can't show you all the outfit um, because I'm running late. We're late. We're supposed to leave at 2. It's almost 3 o'clock. So I have to go. But I'll insert a picture of my um, outfit. I'll insert it here so that you can see it. Okay. I'll catch y'all when we get to our destination. Thank you. Thank you, I got it. So I better be getting drunk. But we're waiting for our table, so <laughs> Yes, thank you. Yes, blue way. Now we really got the Rona. These are 16. Well, I'll pay for the next one. It tastes salty a little bit. It tastes good, I like them. Salty? No, I mean, it's just probably a bit. It's breezy out here. So when we was out there, it was so hot, but like right here, it's not that hot. We've been wearing the shade. 
Yeah, Shay wasn't here, you'd be here. I was here. Plus, we right next to him. Yeah, I took pictures and they came out horribly. He was hot, so he wasn't focused. Remember I told y'all he was the best photographer? They should be a best photographer should be able to work in any circumstances. The heat, the cold, all of that. <laughs> he whipping that jump. Guys, we got our table, and he wants to sit outside, but it's hot. Oh, did you want to sit over here? It feels good right here. I'm in the sun. Say hi. Say hi to my subscribers. Say hi to the Ninja Gang. What's good? Good, boring, throw tomato. <laughs> Market price, market price means expensive. It's a pop. Oh, look at the baby. She's so cute. She's so tiny. Babe, don't you want another baby? <laughs> perfumes or whatever so I ordered from them first before like us like the smaller purchase like the perfume was like $40 before I ordered something big but I have a story behind this so let me open let me start opening it <laughs> so I have a story so basically I had ordered this package like three weeks ago or something um and I got notification like two days later like after I ordered it Aubrey Go over there. I got a notification like three, two to three days later saying the package was delivered. So I was like, oh, perfect. Like, hold on, let me move Sitcha up higher. Um, but I'm like, okay, that means, you know, my husband or my son or something signed for the package because it said it was signed for. And it came really fast, but it came fast the first time. So I was excited. I checked and I don't got anything at my door. So I asked my husband, I said, hey, this package got said it got delivered today. Well, this was the next day. It said it got delivered yesterday. Did you sign for a package? And he was like, no. And I asked my son, and he said no. And I didn't see it. Usually they would sign, they would leave by the door um, if I'm not around or whatever. So, um, see, this is why you need a box cutter because I've been trying to open this for like 10 years. So I, um, USPS, when they send the thing, Say your package delivered is um and it was signed for you can request to uh get the signature page so i requested it and i got the signature page and it said it was signed and the signature said like something weird it said like covid 19 john or something like that so i was like covid 19 but then it brought like i was thinking okay i got something in the oven hold on 
um, USPS, because of COVID, they haven't been delivering to the door. They will ring the doorbell. They will go far back. They will sign for you, but they'll make sure you pick up your package before they sign it or whatever. So I'm like, maybe they did that. So I have um, security cameras in front of our house. I said, let me check the security cameras from the time that it was delivered. It was delivered at like 11.53. So I rewinded it all the way back to that morning and no, nothing was delivered. Like no male person even came near my house not even in the neighborhood so i was like maybe they delivered it to the wrong door or whatever so i'm thinking they probably stole it so i opened up like a case like i called them um and they was like oh you have to file a claim they sent me the link to find a claim someone be back with you within a couple of days no one came no one reached out to me or anything so i'm actually gonna call them again tomorrow because Somebody stole that joint. Like, they was like, I don't know if they knew what was in it or whatever, but there's a perfume that I got. I'm going to show you all. This is the package and how it looks when it comes. I don't know if y'all see it. And it says, Hey, babe, thanks for being the best a part of Revel. We hope you, I hope I'm saying that right. We hope you enjoy your new sense as much as we do. Connect with us, blah, blah, blah. And they have their Instagram and everything on there. And so I got the YSL Libre perfume. And it was, it don't have the price on here, but I think it was like 150-ish or something. Ouch. Let me see. But anyways, so Rebel, I like reached out to them and said, hey, this, you know, it said that this package got delivered and I never got it. And I told them I could send them proof. I could tell I could send y'all my video footage. I could show you my ID that I didn't sign for this package. So they were so kind enough to send me another one. And it's crazy because this perfume is expensive. I mean, it's cheaper than the original price. Um, let me see. So I got the YSL Libre for $105. And it was $100. It's originally $130. So that's a good, you know, still. Um, so whoever got that package, they... You know, they came They came up. Whoever stole it, if they got delivered to the wrong person, they came up because of yeah. is everything like i'm building my little perfume collection so i'm excited for this one i did um get like a little test from sephora before but i never was like i never bought it every time i have a secret every time i go to sephora i'll get samples of this and wear it and never buy it so i de finally decided not to be a broke bitch and buy one you know It smells so. Sometimes I would mix my other YSO perfume. Um, which one is it? It's the Mom Paris one that I have. I'll mix that with my husband's um, Gucci cologne, and it would give me a scent like this. It's kind of like it's kind of musky. I like it. It's like not too feminine. It's kind of like it smells bomb. Like, mm, I really like this company i'll leave the link below if you want to check out the perfumes that they have they have a lot that's on sale it's so it's so freaking hot <sighs> so i'm actually here to close out this vlog because this is a vlog been going on for like a week and a half and I want to start a new vlog, so I'm going to sh close this one out right here. And um, I'm going to go get a drink because I need a drink. I'm I'm over everything. Like I'm over being in the house all the time. I'm over work. I'm over everything. I need a drink. So that's where I'm heading right now to get a drink. Don't you dare do it. I might 
vlog a little bit of um, the spot I'm going to, my meals or whatever, but we'll see. All right, y'all.